Okay, as you can see, I took these pins and I um, marked on here to see which one I want. Um, I really like how, with the purple that you can see, I really like how this green is sticking out and that's because they're complementary colors. They're opposites on the color wheel. I like this blue also, um, but I am, I normally go for stuff like this, so I'm just trying to do a little something different. So, I'm trying to do all this one-handed. Okay. Now, what I'm going to do now is now I'm going to look at my picture. Got all my art supplies everywhere. Um, I'm looking at my picture, and I'm looking at places that obviously need more dots. But, <laughs> hold on. But I also have to remember, I don't necessarily want it to be perfect where everything is totally the same amount and it just goes out. Again, the beauty of this and the galaxy is that it doesn't have to be perfect. It can be a little thicker over here or whatever because that's kind of how stars are. They are not like in a straight row. So, because I have the green, which is, you know, a new color. So, I'm going to go around and I'm slow and patient even though... Sometimes my back is hurting and I just want to hurry. So I'm going to just put on some dots. Slow down because I saw my dots getting. Now, as I'm doing this, I'm wondering if green is what I was looking for. I mean, it's beautiful. So I am like, I like to do things in threes. <laughs> so we're not going to count the silver. But I do think that I'm going to want a brighter color than this. Because I want it, I like it to um, stand out like the white. But again, this is just where my mind is right now. Um, like I tell students, you don't really know what's going to happen. And, you know, where you think that you mess up on a picture, really it's just an opportunity to problem solve or an opportunity to switch the mood and reasoning for your art. So, um, that's why I'm going to just tell you where I'm at right now. Um, let me see. Okay, so that's filling in. As you can see, when you come down here, man, that looks really cool. I love these. Um, but when you come down here, you can see all the dots. Man, that's cool. Y'all are going to be excited when you do this. Okay. So, um, I am liking my dots. They look better on camera, actually. Like, they look brighter on my camera. Um, but I'm just going to add a little bit more. It's, they're not as bright on the canvas um, as they are on my camera. I wish they were neon like that. But, oh, I wonder if something you can see the purple. Okay. Um... Okay, so I'm starting to get full. I'm, I don't want to do too much. And I don't want to get to where, you know, with me being a math brain, having a math brain, um, I can really get stuck up on, you know, trying to make things <laughs> even, even if it's not symmetrical or quote unquote perfectly even. I'll try to get like one side to be about the same weight as the other side, even though they're not placed the same, that's asymmetrical. Um, so, I do like that. Again, it looks so much brighter on my camera. Um, but I have to be careful because I get, sometimes I get in the zone because I almost feel like a sewing machine because sewing machines go do, 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 do. But, um, I have to be a little bit more deliberate about my dots, which means as I'm looking, I'm kind of planning. Like, okay, I see a lot right here and I see it. As it goes out, there's less. And that makes, it really accentuates the circle. So as I'm doing it, I'm looking for holes in the area, but I'm trying to keep it far away. The more dots of each color that I add, the thicker it's gonna be. And since this is gonna be a galaxy print, um, I will be using paint splatter and other techniques to show more texture to where it looks more like a galaxy. Now with 
dot stuff like this could be your painting. Sometimes less is more. And that is cool. Um, let me see, what other colors did I do? I kind of like that salmon colored one. So I'm gonna try that if I can figure out which one it is. I do this one handed, but I just want you to kind of see ooh, the process that I go through, you know, um, because here it is on a Friday night and I love this. So, um, but it is something that is time consuming. Okay, so I found like my coral and I think that's kind of what I'm looking for. Let's see, it's not as bright as I would like it in front of me. It looks totally different on the camera. So I'm just gonna quickly, I'm just gonna put some of these dots because again, can't do wrong. I like colors, so more colors make it cool. Not exactly what I planned. Not really what I've planned during the whole thing. I didn't do a lot of green in here, so I wanna kinda incorporate some other different colored dots in here. And honestly, I'm probably gonna get another color because I'm just extra like that sometimes. Can't help it. Okay, so I might just kinda blend in. Oh, that looks cool. Okay. just looking where there's a spot that could use a dot. <laughs> a spot that could use a dot. A spot that could use a dot. Okay, I need to go back to my goal, which is incorporating more dots down here. And I'm doing this just because it gives more depth because my dots aren't all white. And so it kind of um, adds a little bit more character to it. And the darker color makes it seem farther away too. Because like stars that are close to the earth, they are very bright. They're not necessarily the biggest ones, but because they're close to the earth, they're brighter than the other ones. So that's kind of what I, you know, I can have some that stand out there, but I really don't want it to stand out that much. So since these colors, since the color colors aren't working and um, it looks a lot cooler on camera, but, and I think it'll look fine, but to me, I'm starting to look like that's really circled with that color. And then it's like, psh, and I really like this. That's really good. I like that when I'm looking through the camera, especially. Um, and splattering will be cool. But I think I'm just going to go to good old gold. Or maybe bronze. I like bronze. Okay. Um, ooh, I do have this yellow. Let me see this. Did I try this one? Is that the one I just did? Let's test it real quick. Yes, that is the one I just did. 